starting recording. Um, so, I don't know what it is about Realm Royale that's making me enjoy it more than PUBG. Maybe because the problems between that and Fortnite are a lot different. And PUBG, like PUBG Fortnite versus Realm Royale. I will say all three of them are very uh, unique in the um, uh, Battle Royale category in the sense of, well, first of all, let me fucking get situated with this game and figure out where the fuck I want to go to next. You just saw A2. Yeah. Which means... There's this thing by the forest. That's at the edge of the forest, the door you went through. Yeah. So if you just go back to the village... Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, going back through the village this mm-hmm. way. Uh, now, how does one go about that? Uh, the, 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 I think it's. I, I first have to go up this ladder. I know that for sure. Um, and I think I go. No, that's John Ball. I think you go down that way. The right, and then go down this. Um, ladder. I don't know. Like, I feel like. Okay, so PUBG is more your like super hyper realistic, but not really realistic. Uh, um, Battle Royale, where you have to, like, it, it's more about the long game than yeah. it is about the, like, in-your-face short game. Yeah. Um, loot's a real thing, you have, uh, the, the fog wall, or the, the fucking blue chiz is more of an issue, um, and, oh my god, <laughs> Um, so, so basically, like, PUBG is centered around hyper-realism, whereas Fortnite is centered a lot around hyper-surrealism, I guess? Stylism? Stylized? Stylized. Uh, yeah, they're, they're more about the show of the game than anything, <laughs> but they, they do focus a lot on balance of gameplay, too. Yeah. Um, but it's... It's very cartoony in a sense of like all the emotes and how the characters look, how it sort of plays as well. And it makes them way more money. Um, <laughs> oh yeah, it makes them a shit ton of money. And then on top of that, like they, uh, it focuses more on short game. It focuses more on how well you can close the distance between you and the fucker shooting at you. And I then heard they added a uh, a shopping cart. Yes. They added a shopping cart. Now card. that's weird. A little goofy. Um. I, I, I have no thoughts one way or the other about the shopping cart. <laughs> um. And then with Rem Morale, I've, I've noticed it's, I mean, it's really rough around the edges because it's early access. Um. Really rough around the edges. Oh, yeah. Um. But at least it's, at least the loot is easy to find. It's easy to start, like, early game battles. Um, but you go down, like, uber quick in the game, too. It's like, early game, two shots, you're down. But, like, when late game comes around, it's almost impossible to take people out with two shots. Yeah. We always end up running those people with, like, the super high armor. Yeah, and it's just like, uh, it's like people, like a whole squad of full golds, and it's just like, what the fuck? Like we ran into last night, that last game we were yeah, just, it just like in the... sitting in the goddamn back room. Um, yeah, exactly. So it's just, uh, I mean, we, we didn't run into anybody the entire time, even though we were pushing the center of the zone. It didn't make any sense. No, it made no sense whatsoever. But uh, I... Because I've played all three, ex- well, other than Realm Royale, I've played PUBG and Fortnite extensively, like, Realm Royale does feel a lot different than the other two. And I think that's why you like it, is, um, it's not the same as the I other think, two. I think the chicken gives you a lot more urgency, and the lack of fall damage. That's yeah. actually what it really is. The lack of fall damage, and, you, like, when you get down to your chicken, and you get a lot more weight, like... It compares to the other two a lot more yeah. mobility than you're ever allowed. Yeah, where the other two, it's just like, once you go down... Um, you're practically dead. Yeah, exactly. At least with the chicken, it gives you a little bit of a chance to like get away and try to trick your opponents and allow for anybody that's like interjecting with the combat to take um, sights away from you. Um, so yeah, the, the chicken does add a nice little aspect to it. Um, also, it's... 
<clears throat> um, yeah, the fall damage too. So you really don't have to worry about moving around too much. Um, yeah, it really is just those two things, isn't it? Well, forge. Uh, the forge is more about um, like with Fortnite, there is something that's like the forge. Not exactly, but it's the idea of like you gathered this this these many resources, you should be able to use them besides building. Yeah. So they have vending machines to where you can um, oh. trade your resources to get uh, better item or better items if you find the right vending machine. Um, so, in that sense, like there there is an aspect of that in Fortnite at the very least, not at the same level because with uh, with Realm Royale, you can do it almost instantly after dropping. Yeah. You just need to grind up this stuff a little bit. I have to say, as... As bad as game decisions as Adams makes while he plays, it's always very funny to watch him play. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dude, that is, by the way, it is three times that he's started to forge something while the storm is literally, literally like, right, right fucking there. And it's like, what the fuck is happening right now? Well, he's, he's like, oh, I was looking at the map. I'm like, that's not my fault. Like, remember when we all left him? Yeah. And he was like, what happened? I'm like, well, all of us got the idea to run away. Like, <laughs> yeah. Okay, I got it. This yeah, time. okay. You gotta find three of those. I kind of forgot where. Yeah, there's. One of them I know is. there's one over in like this area. It's the place that I have to drop down to, right? I thought. Which I didn't do yet. Um. Maybe I don't remember. Um, um, I'll I'll go there anyways. But yeah, like. There anyways. It's funny because like Adams is not he's, he's not a, audio learner. He has to learn by like, like having it happen to him. <laughs> yeah, kinesthetic. Yeah, Fucking thank you. hands-on okay. knowledge. Yeah, he's a hands-on learner. Yeah. And Mine, mine's all, like, experience-based at this point. It's all kinesthetic, but it's all, like, I've done this once like, or twice before. If, if I were, like, yeah, like, you probably, like, all right, like... And if I fuck up once, I probably won't fuck up again. But it's, like... I don't know, it's just, it's just, there's certain things where I tell Adam's, like, hey, man, like, this is, this is, like, oh, well, I get it now. And it's just, like... Why couldn't you get it early? I don't think it was that hard. Just the the, the whole comment hit scan? <laughs> oh, and I was just like, I get it now. <laughs> we were talking about how the heirloom went from a uh, hit scan to, to a, a very fast projectile. Yeah. yeah. Hit scan? Uh, and Dakota put it the best way Call of Duty. Yeah, but like, he still, will, he still won't understand the concept of hit scan. Like, yeah. like. And Unless, I was like, yeah. I just, I just got out of order care anymore. I'm just not going to explain. Because yeah. it's just like, he'll be like, oh yeah, you were right when you said this. I'm like, well, yeah, I already, I already knew I was right when I said it the first time. I, oh, you were right when you said this. Yeah, no shit. That's why I told you. <laughs> oh, that's funny. And he's just like, I'm like, yeah, this is just like, God damn it, Adams. <laughs> um, yeah. So... But he, like, he, it's not like he's, like, a bad person or anything. He's just... Uh, it's just terrible game sense. And, oh, like, yeah. That's, it's, that is no, like, that has no gauge on whether uh, a person's, like, um, whatchamacallit, um, shit, uh, character? Yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. Ooh. I think, yeah, I think you have the jump up there or something. Uh, I got a dash jump to it, don't I? Oh, uh, let me... Um, but, like, yeah. Which... I never told you about this. Nine S is in the way. It's. I think it's somewhere around here. I could. I could be wrong. Well, yeah. I know. I saw. Welcome to this that, game's awkward camera system. That makes me. <laughs> that, dude, it was all because of the camera system. It wasn't yeah, because of anything yeah, else. I know. Um. Oh god, this is uh when Tobon first got his switch, which like made me super angry because uh. Oh, fuck. My. It's just jump, jump. I was a mentor to somebody while I was at Pensacola, and he he was at an Amazon store and he bought me he bought me my Switch right and then mailed it to me, mm -hmm. and then I was like really enjoying it and then Tobon Tobon got like super jealous of my Switch because he wanted to bring it on on the boat with him for duty days and stuff. Yeah. 
And then he was just like, there we go. <laughs> So what Tobon does is buys a switch on eBay. Oh, I lied. Oh, it's on the other side. On the other side, remember on like on the library where I was? On like go, yeah, keep going down that hallway. Yeah. I think it's up here. Like you got to go up top somewhere. Yeah, and I'm just, uh, obviously I'm doing this for yeah. the XPs. Um, so anyways, yeah, the Switch, Tobon, take to Tobon bought a, a Switch on eBay for like 450 Jesus Just for the Switch. Christ I was like, Christ you could have just waited Christ. for it to come in stock, and they just, oh, well, blah, 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 blah. Just like, we got to talk about how much of an impulse buyer he is. Yeah, he, he gave that person $150 in profit just because he's impatient. Yeah, so I think that's it right there. Yeah. Um, uh, and then, have to go so, up like, they're, like, he had people over, they were playing Mario Kart. Mm-hmm. And like, they're like, "Oh yeah, let's go play Mario Kart." Like, okay, like you guys can go play. Like, I'm I'm fine. I don't need to play. Go around the loop around the other way, maybe. Yeah. Um, and then so I have I trial and error right now. Yeah. So I was, I was just like sitting. I was like, okay, I don't need to play Mario Kart. Like, I'm good. Um, everybody else grabbed a controller except for Adams and Tobon, and like, Adams grabs the controller like from Tobon, or like not from Tobon. He grabs it before Tobon does. I want to say. And, like, Tobon, like, no words, just starts trying to choke Adams, like, like, legitimately just, like, straight for the throat and just, like, try to choke him. And so, like, me, I was like, okay, I know this is uncalled for, so, like, I gave it, I, I get, like, a 10 second timer for, for un, unworn situations like that. I think you already got that one. I didn't get the one down here. Are you trying to jump over the cross? Nope. I'm trying to, there we go. No. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Um, and so, like, uh, Reed, who you haven't met because he doesn't, he doesn't get on Discord, um, he stops him before I stop him. And, like, but I was just like, at that point, like, that's, that's when I lost, like, a lot of respect for Tobon, where he, like, choked out somebody over Mario Kart, before even playing, mind you. <laughs> yeah. Like, for it's, the uh, right to play Mario Kart, and just like, it's it's a little much. Yeah, like the, like, the one and only time <laughs> I've choked somebody out was my brother, and it was because it was three a.m. and this had been the tenth time that he's come home drunk from somewhere with oh, his girlfriend, Robert. and they were yelling in Robert. the fucking kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> And I, I fucking had enough of it, and I was just like, I, I go, I went out, told him to shut up, and he was just like, tell her to shut up, tell her to shut up. It's like I'm telling this, you this to shut the, up. And uh, then, well, this is the girl crazy one, right? Yeah, and um, and then eventually, like, I had enough, and I just like, at yeah. first, I tried telling him to be quiet, and then uh, then I started joking him. <laughs> um, yeah, but at least it wasn't like, I want to play Mario Kart. <laughs> like, like. I'm not saying, like, because, like, it's Tobon Switch. Like, technically, he has the rules and rights whoever uses and plays it. Yeah. But, like, I still feel like he went a little... Yeah, no, that is overboard. Because <laughs> what you should really say is, be like, what you should really do is just, like, no, you give that back to me. It's my Switch. Yeah, yeah. It's just, like... Not fucking straight up to the neck and choke I, somebody maybe out. Maybe words were explained, but, like, I remember the choking way more than I remember anything else. Because, like, like, cause it was just kind of, like... That's it was where out it of nowhere. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just like like it, it, it escalated so quickly that there probably was no conversation to be had before the choke. God damn this fucking worm! <laughs> before the choking happened. Yeah. yeah. Let's let's put it that way. Oh. Where, where's the last? Oh. One? Okay. You had the you had the cross it not go underneath. Yeah, I I, I kind of figured. I think so. I was just trying we to. We should probably move the mouse out the way the top left of the screen. So I just realized that. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I, I was like, because you never knew that, I'm guessing, clearly, from your reaction when you heard me say that he choked somebody out over Mario Kart. No, 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 <laughs> that's that's one story that has not been... Uh... Yeah, it's just like, yeah, yeah, you know, left and go to that cross over there. Okay, so, okay, yeah. I see what you're saying, I have to, like, I still have to drop down. Yeah, but you have to, like, go across, not go underneath. Okay, um... It's really unfortunate if you fall. There we go. Um, I wasn't sure if I had the dash. Yeah, but it's just like it. it's just like yeah. It, for that's what I lost like a lot of respect for. I was like, hey, you know what? I'm gonna get out of this place a little sooner than later. Analysis. <laughs> so it's Analysis processing. Processing. Processing complete. Shut 
<laughs> Search for a door that matches the key, which my guess is that door that was down below. Remember when you saw me playing this game? I was yeah. doing this quest. Yeah, you were. Oh, you, I was fucking you, there. You, you just no, go to the right. It's. I know. Um, I don't think you want to complete this task on this playthrough. <laughs> But that's just me. Well, I'm already fucking heading towards the door, so GG. Uh, it's, uh, it's no, above. No. Yeah, it's above. Yeah, It's through the one window that's broken, right? Yeah, you remember you had that black screen thing that you kept messing up with? The... Like, the, you, like you would go to the end, there's that cave on the other side, on that other end? Yeah. That's where, that's where the door is. Gotcha, that... gotcha. Um, but, yeah. but, oh, so that was, that was like near you moving out. I want to say it was like within... A month and a half of me moving out. Okay. Wow. <laughs> all right. I I really wasn't sure how like, like soon it was. It, in all honesty, like if Toblad came to try to choke me out over giving Mario Kart, like well, I don't think I would like yeah, cause him to do that. Oh boy, he would have not had a fun time. <laughs> no. Yeah. It had it had been like half a second, and then he would have hit the uh, uh, hit the ground. And, like it would have been like. If he would have choked me, I would have just packed my stuff and just left. Like, cut <laughs> off the cut off the power, like, put myself off the lease, because I was the only one on the lease the entirety of my yeah, time Yeah, and basically there. make them seem like squatters. Because if, oh. uh, yeah, that's, that's basically what <laughs> would happen. Yeah. Well, it is it is actually the other place's fault, because someone didn't put himself on the lease initially, and they didn't do it. So. But, like. Oh, he was level, like, 65 when I fought him. So I thought they would have put him at 65. That's no. why I said I wouldn't recommend coming here. Okay, so it's a uh, scale? I guess. Um, but I remember him having a lot of health. Yeah, that's what it's seeming like right now. <laughs> um, yeah, no. Uh, like, yeah, definitely. Someone does something like that to me. It would have been like, yeah, I'm going to just not. I'm just going to leave. Like, I would have packed my stuff, like, immediately like, while they were at work. Cut off, my, cut off the power, cut off the... <laughs> The ga gas and electric bill that I was paying, and then just left. And it would have been like, like, why'd you leave? I'm like, I'm not gonna live with you. Like, oh, <laughs> and it, yeah. to me, it's still surprising that like, Tobin and Adams don't have like any huge animosity towards each other because I, I've never, mm. I've never seen, I haven't seen an apology <laughs> that I know of. Yeah, it it might have happened <laughs> without your knowledge, um, but. I, don't like, know. I feel like Adams would have said something. Yeah. Because, like, it, we've talked about it in Discord, because I told Dakota about it, like, a couple days ago, and Adams definitely never seemed like Tobin ever apologized for it. Yeah. Dude, <laughs> like, I apologize whenever I say something that, like, seems fucking mean. Um, and I'm like, I'm not really thinking about my words as I say them, so, like, something may come across, like, really douchey, but I, I like, I don't mean it that way. Yeah. And, like, I'll apologize for that. As far as, well, I mean, I probably never apologized to... Actually, I think I did say sorry to Bert for, for doing that. Vaguely, though. Because um, <laughs> I think I was, like, still pissed off when I did it. Or when I said sorry. Yeah. But, yeah. Um, so, it's it for me... Because, like, it, it's super awkward to me that they, like, can still be, like... Yeah... Yeah, that is that is really awkward. I mean, it it's either a case of like their their friendship can overcome that sort of thing, but also I don't see them together. Like, do you see them like whenever you go uh, whenever you talk to them in Discord? Is like both of them there? That's what I was what I what I was what I was gonna get. Uh oh. What the fuck? How oh, gay. <laughs> I died over there. I'm, I'm keeping that, keep... by the way. Now you have to pick up the dead body. You can run away from the battle if you want. That's a long yeah, ass battle. Yeah, that's, that's a, that is a really long ass battle. Um, and I think it's more of the fact that I'm there that's what it is. Like, Adams will sit in the Discord, and I don't think Tobon, like, because Adams will sit in the Discord just by himself. And yeah. I'll go in, because, like, if, I, if I'm if i free, if Adams is there on his own. And, uh... And then Tobon will come in after, after that, right? Okay, Tobon or Adams will be in the Discord by themselves a lot of the time. Okay. But they're never in there together, and they have very, very similar work schedules, clearly, because they're in the same... 
Okay. They're on the same so base, not on the same boat. The, uh, there is animosity there. It's just like they're both too passive aggressive to to do anything about it. It that is that is my opinion. It's probably wrong, but I don't I don't consider Togon passive aggressive. He's just passive. He's just passive. <laughs> like okay, it's just the the aggressive part of the passive. Yeah, but I mean, with the whole choking out thing, wouldn't you say like you'd probably put him back into the passive aggressive category? I. There's times where Tobon needs to, wants to prove he's the alpha male, and Adams is not that person to check him on that. Yeah. Uh, cause like, even if I did take the control, I don't think Tobin would have choked me at all. He would have been like, he would have just asked for it back. He would have realized like that that's not gonna fly here. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I think it's more over about Adams. You should probably just can't you, can't you just teleport to the top? Can't you just teleport to the top. Use fast travel. Oh yeah, I probably should. <laughs> Sorry, I'm listening to this fucking stupid conversation. I know, I know you hate Sixo. I know you hate Sixo because she's just so terrible. She's just like <coughs> yeah, the top of the factory. Yeah, factor. no, no, it's the royal chamber. Royal chamber, yeah. Yeah, she reminds me of a um, like an airhead. <laughs> just kind of like too self-involved and not really paying attention to what's going on whenever she makes uh, suggestions it's because <laughs> she wants or needs something yeah yeah or it's yeah. all like surface stuff i don't know i hate 6 <laughs> <laughs> um yeah I, I also don't get people that have to like prove themselves the alpha in certain situations it's like there there's one you gain nothing from it other than oh you're, you're the alpha in the room so everybody has to like listen and look at you but you also put yourself in a position where people are like look at this fucking asshole <laughs> but like uh it's it's it that that part of his life, like it, it only it not it doesn't constrict it constricts over everywhere in his life, and it's just kind of like, it's really unfortunate that he yeah that is very feels the need to prove himself at a lot of things. Oops, that is the wrong button. Yes. Yes. All right, go fuck yourself. <laughs> I'll be back some other day. <laughs> with some other like upgraded equipment i think that's also part of it is like my you have the so. chips are kind of dookie yeah yeah my chips are dookie my equipment's like not upgraded so i say go teleport back because you the store would well, if you're to continue the store you don't need to be here yeah and walking back this way is kind of bad but nope it's already happening <laughs> um yeah and adams is a lot is like is even more passive <laughs> than tobon is okay so it's... at least in life in video games he's like super aggressive as you can tell because, like, Tobon doesn't come with us when we go attack people in, in, in yeah, yeah. any game, better yet. but in... So it's just, a, it's just a case of two people that aren't willing to talk about any sort of situations that are real. Uh, stuck in this fucking weird, awkward limbo of... We actually truly hate each other, but we're gonna do nothing about it. I don't think they truly hate each other. They just like, it's just like that one uh, spat, I, yeah. Once again, it's, it's uh, all... Uh, yeah, anecdotal and yeah. hyperbolic and yeah, all yeah, that nonsense. Yeah. Um, I just like for for me, it's more like, yeah, I guess that's the case. And like, if it weren't for me, I feel like they wouldn't have any interaction at all. Um, that is what the fuck. Oh, I know where that is. Okay. In the Forest Kingdom, there's like a place you can travel through it. It connects to the amusement park where you met. Okay, and it's down. Not, in that not the scene. amusement park. Um, the shopping center where he, where Nine S wanted to get you some shoes or some shit like that. Oh. Remember I'm... where you met that weird face that rolled away? That's what that leads oh, to. It okay. connects that way. All right. I don't even. Okay. So Which jackass actually, do me a favor. Go to the desert. Go to the desert place. Go there. No. Well, you look. said the desert. I mean, no, no, no. The de where the jackass's research is. Okay. Uh. That's the resistance disappearance. What's that one? 
Uh, Lost Girl. No, uh, fuck that. I'm not yeah. touching that one after you told me what it is. Um, yeah, she asked you weird questions like, where do babies come from? Fuck it. Uh, might as well just... Do you know, I need you to do me a favor. Go, go to the, de- go to the camp, the camp one. Where, uh, where Jackass is. Uh, camp, it's desert camp. Desert camp, yeah. Now, when you get there, head to the dojo place. You know the dojo guy is on the top of the building? Is the desert camp closest to that? Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't sure which one was like the the closest to the dojo. Yeah, so it, it's just a bunch of like passive people, and they don't have like a lot of. Uh... One of the bigger things is just like. Yeah, keep going that way. Um, oh, it is because that's the building right there. I have to explain a lot of things to. To tell Blood and Adams when I have to, but it's just like. <laughs> this is actually why I wanted you to come here. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I am. No, you can use your little bullets. Little tiny bullets. Fucking stop that shit. Oh my god. Now this thing's attacking. What the fuck did you just do? Me? What What, what did you bring me to? What is this? <laughs> just, just... I, I, I'm not even fucking evading right because I'm so perturbed. <laughs> Oh, it's oh, no. this fucking guy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, so, boy. so, so. All right. Look before you before you continue. I'm gonna say this and say this right now. He that thing is the only thing that makes this game a sequel. And so, if you really want to figure out the lore of this game, he's the most important figure in the goddamn game. This dumbass goofball. <laughs> And he has fucking... No! <laughs> Look at the numbers. The cost. They're all 21. Don't buy anything from him. He... So, just a heads... What a dickhead! Just a heads up. He spawns in, like, like four different locations around the city. Mm-hmm. And, like, each spot, he'll sell different stuff. <laughs> so, like, when you come back, when you leave and come back, he'll just be roaming around places, and you can just buy different <laughs> stuff from him if you want. No! Um... Yeah. Emil, Emil's great, isn't he? Yeah, I think I'm gonna stick with what you said, like, seven's your top. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> hmm. These two are five, so I'm gonna hold on to them. Okay, that's... that's do you want to do a side quest featuring him? Oh, this is weird. <laughs> wanna know where I live? I didn't ask that. <laughs> They go deeper. Do you want to try to go to his house? Not really. Not right now. Doorbell? Um. That's a doorbell. It's it's been. It's been thirty minutes. Yeah, let's say it's been.